let us continue. We just finished the Empress, which was the challenge to get a bunch of fame. I think we'll just go down the line here, even though these are um, these are all like um, unlocked. Let's just do this next one here. The Emperor sounds sounds hard. Okay. Okay, the Emperor. Thieves have stolen a relic from the Emperor's palace. The Empire are looking to hire adventurers to help recover. All right, let's look at the modifiers. We've got Explorer. The road ahead may be long. Make sure you have enough food. Ooh, it's gonna be a very, very big maps. Okay. Bandit country. Um, lots of thieves. Okay. Pathfinder, use map reveal to navigate the treacherous wild. Oh my God. You and Neil deGrasse Tyson are my idols. But you say that to uh, but you say that to every uh, Twitter YouTuber out there. All right, let's go supplies here. So we want to keep on doing the soldier's sword. Our companion. I need to see what his ability is. Um, inspect. Okay. So three abilities. Twenty second cooldown. When activated, he performs a charge attack that stuns down. Stay close to charge the ability faster. Bonus dice when rolling. Uh, optionally roll an extra dice after the missing dice gambit target but lose your companion for three turns melee fighter oh this is actually pretty nice roll an extra dice after missing the dice yeah I like that one a lot I doubt the North we'll, we'll use them offer you anything time will tell time will tell all right these are the encounters wow look at that one dude I have no idea what this one is it looks insane dude all right, well, like I said, we want to do everything. Like, how do I finish this one? I don't know how to finish this one. Token, gain gold, map reveal. I don't understand. All right, so we're doing every single one. Oh, look, there's filters. Oh, that's pretty cool. All right, every single one with tokens. Requires mallet clips. Aw. All right, let's go back. Let's go back. Let's finish all of mallet clips as one, then. I didn't know he... All mages are my children. This all right, one, we'll do all of uh, Malik Clips' so ones. All right, grab all the ones with tokens. That's it. Okay, let's get some new ones. Uh, we got um, Elder's Gift, Bridge Skirmish, Fame, Shame, Gnomish Exchange, Watchtower. And then we'll grab one that I really like. Let's see. This one was okay. Pit Pocket. Oh, you can keep doing this one to get hella money. You can do the old one. This is actually this one's pretty good for money. I'll do it. Like that was not bad. Okay, so this one requires like it tells you how much fame you need, right? Twenty fame, dude. That's almost impossible to get. I mean, we got it, but still. Okay, let's grab the new ones. All the new ones. Uh, let's see, gluttony. It's a new one. We get Berserker's Creed. Uh, shield. Uh, shield reflect. We'll grab that one. I don't want. I mean, I'll grab some weapons just in case. Okay, so two weapons, one shield, two armors, a bunch of rings, and a bunch of other stuff. All right, seems good. Let's go. Mm. These foes I place before you. These rules. I do not know truly if they will train mm -mm -mm. for the challenges that Callus will place in your way. You watching me? And Black Ops 3 YouTubers? Of course, Have you seen my my Call of Duty playthrough? The wow, I'm only seven the watching. On the Use the viewer's Behind command. Him, the usurper pulls the I'll do it myself. The one who sits upon the throne of life and death has a great influence upon the world. Okay. The very soul <clears throat> permeates the lands and fills the hearts of the people. Okay. <clears throat> okay. The shrill voice of the town crier rings out across the market. The Emperor himself seeks Adventures Guild members. Urgent expedition vile to the safety of the Empire. You spot a crowd of travelers weighed down with weapons and tools lingering nearby. The Empire is offering a reward just to set off on the expedition. Even more if you make it back. That's how desperate they are for help. The dealer adds a gold counter to the map. Gold counter? Oh, we stepped on gold and we got gold. But in the end, they take everything. Okay, on arriving at the gates of the royal palace, an armed escort leads you directly to the emperor's chambers. The emperor remains still and silent as the chief council lays out the expedition. All right, few relics from the last age still endure in this world. We had one in this very room last night. 
She gestures to an empty pedestal. Not only must you reclaim the stolen symbol, but we ask that you gather the three sibling relics. Who stole it? Uh, okay. Examine the pedestal. Okay, whatever, right? I am ready to go. See our training officer on the way out. A keen eye will notice that themes repeat themselves. All Vents right. Too. The wheel ever turns. You are greeted by Captain Estrella Fjord. Thieves are cowards at heart. They will dodge your heaviest attacks just as they dodge their civic duty. A swift blade is best to defeat them. Here, try these out. Dual wield weapons are effective against fast enemies like thieves, but are weak against armored. Whoa! Understood. These are new. If you are at war, use every tool at your disposal. Light weapon, 18 hits. Perform six strikes that cause a stun to thieves. Against thieves, repost deals 125% damage. And light increases hit during a combo. Repost can interrupt counterattacks. Ooh. Oh, it didn't even give me an option. It's like, here, equip it. Whoa, this map is huge! Still, you find yourself hunting Mother fucker. Do you not wonder why or what they may do? Find the four relics and deliver them. Oh, this is a cool looking map, man. All right, let's do this. What's that thing up there on the top? Okay, let's go this one. Watch it's a new one. Low. Make your choices carefully. On the edge of the Empire, far from the capital, sits a lonely watchtower. You approach. Halt calls a soldier. None may cross the border. Sneak past, go along the way. Let's we'll sneak. We're trying to sneak past. You return hours later as night approaches. You hope they don't spot you. Uh, okay, 12? That's pretty easy. Alright. Feels bad, man. Yay. Alright. You scale without incident. You gain two fame. Nice. Whoa! That showed everything. That's a pretty cool looking... Uh, that's, that's a pretty awesome... Uh, you turn your gaze north and south. So if you are able to do the tower, you can see everything here. Oh, look at all those dangerous wilds. Oh, screw that. Yeah. F that. Dude, I'm so glad we had the watchtower. That's very useful. This is the cartographer. There are nine revealed encounters. Okay, so we have to reveal everything and then return later, right? Return later. Like, we have to reveal a crap ton before he, he'll give us anything, I think. I can't see the map, game. That is burning building. Not the burning building again. Jesus. We keep failing this These one. Tokens represent the All right, we'll do the fire ourselves. Here we go. More options, more cards, more opportunities. Okay, so it just gets faster and faster. What? No, we're good. We can use Malaclips to reroll one time. To fame, return to the building. I'm not a vein. You oh. must appreciate that the game, this yeah, game, yeah, yeah. has been my focus for more years than I can count. I have a certain pride regarding its twists. Dude, F you game. Yo, F it. Oh my god, they're all dead. Return to the building. Alright, I'll keep going. Oh. Come on, go, go, go. Arrgh. How many times can you keep going, though? Ouch. Like, I'm not worried about dying by fights, so go ahead and do all that. Oh my god, dude. That has to be a win. Hey, oh. Got him. All right. Eight fame. You are unable to save everybody. <sighs> I'm going to guess you have to save everyone for that one to work. All right. The treacherous wilds. Damn. Every fresh encounter will cause you damage. <gasps> We're out of food? Carefully. While traversing a dangerous cliff face, you slip and lose your footing. Oh no, I lost food? Supplies Whatever. Are exhausted. Unless you find some food, you will surely perish. I can camp. Those I'm going who are to camp. can never hope to get the best possible price. Alright, we're gonna camp and we're going to trade and hopefully get some food. 
Uh, 15 gold for three food. Oh my god. Rip off, man. One food for six, rip off as well. Alright, I just have to keep going. The Your treacherous wilds again. Dude, this is rough, dude. You just dropped food like left and right. Peaceful. Someone jumped on us. You, the erratic thieves movement crosses your path. Just hold them off for a couple minutes while we're ready to the horses. So if we if we destroy these guys, we're gonna get a relic. So this is a movement encounter. Oh, that's really cool. This is a pretty interesting, um, really interesting uh, campaign or challenge, whatever. All right, first time using the dual weapons. Yay, so cool. Sugoi desu. Hmm, maybe. All right, a pair, a lovely pair of fine blades fit for the finest gentleman. Well sharpened and cared for and deadly. Holy crap, I have 40 seconds to kill them all. Gotta just go at it, man. Easy peasy. Holy god. Oh my god, this weapon's insane. I mean, it's very terrible against armed, armed people, but oh my god. Hey, what's up, man? Welcome to the stream. This is insane. 10 seconds? Oh my god, please, please, game, please. 10 seconds. Uh oh, 9. Come on, dude. No! Oh, that was really close, dude. Damn, that was like really close. Hmm. Alright, we did it. We're all looking for fame. What's this? The new wielder we're gaining curse. Oh. That's nice. Lose a random equipment when you lose a curse. Whatever. Hmm. Damn, dude. All right. Ten gold. Which all weapons? Perhaps Guys, I could really use the food, here. please. All right. Oh, the bridge skirmish. I just added this one. Uh, from your viewing angle, you notice that the bridge structure has been damaged. With luck, they'll be able to knock out one of the supports with a thrown object, causing the bridge to collapse. Throw a piece, throw a rock. We'll fight. Light weapons are weakest against Empire armor. You can change your... Oh, we'll change it then. Cool, we can change before each fight, which is great. God, we have a lot of weapons on us. How do we get so many of these weapons? Oh, these three are just basic weapons. Like, basic weapons you can't sell. This is the supply one, and this is the one they gave us. So that's why we have so many weapons. You can't sell those three that I just got. Which makes sense. Alright, Coolio. Let's do it. This is gonna be a long campaign, I can feel it. Look at these musketeer yikes. Deadly at a distance, only the most skilled are recruited into musketry. Musketeers fire heavy attacks. Defend with the shield, use Elsa Vade for your life. destroy him first then 12 damage dude okay get that repost going man I think I'm just gonna sit here and repost these I think I will destroy the other musketeer though but I will repost to finish this challenge so I don't have to worry about using this weapon and I can focus on the other ones okay so let's just repost I don't know how many I have left. Oops, my bad. Come on. <laughs> Whoops. Ah, oh, guys, so fast. Come on. Come at. That's enough. <laughs> God damn, we're gonna die.
Mm-hmm. Nice equipment. Oh, new armor. Gain three defense if you have 20 plus food. Huh. Okay. Receive one food for every food gain or gold card. Oh, that's extremely good. We have way more than enough fame. So that's Ancient a really, really good item. The same and five food. Oh, thank you. God How damn handle you. hunger and resources during battle. Mm. A moment of mm -hmm. peace on your travels. Savor it. Oh, wow. Drop, um, oh, five health. Oh, no, that's fine. We're still up health. Here we begin oh, my God, to see the potential of cards based around fame. Oh, if you can force them from your <clears throat> deck and into your hands, you can begin to exploit their power. Why don't you have one million subs on YouTube? Um, people don't like me, my videos suck. Alas, the Raiders have destroyed our village. Let me give you some advice preparation is key to victory. Never begin a quest without first stacking the deck in your favor. There is no platinum equipment in the deck. There isn't? Really? I get eight fame from just walking on there. That's pretty cool. Children uh -oh. Are oh, this is nice. This is the next Malaclips one. They have an excess of All right, sick, sick. All right. You linger near a fort in the abandoned docks of the great city. Malaclips sidles out of an alley and strokes his mustache. Well, coin slave, the Empire has stolen the mage children, hidden away in there. Now, I'm not fond of children, as you well know. You recall a time when Malaclips was asked to relinquish the last sweet roll of a crying child. He refused. <laughs> but Ira won't give me the cure if we don't rescue them. He outlines the plan to you. It is a warring brief. These forts are all interconnected, so even if we defeat one of the guards, they're bound to call reinforcements, so we'll have to get in and out quick. Defeat two steel monster cards within 60 seconds. Interesting. Find a way in, ask about the plan, let's go. Oh my god. Ew! Hidden beneath the pile of refuse, you find a grate that leads, presumably, under the fort. Without considering, without considering your wishes, an eclipse of wet as the grate open and ascends. You follow sloot, but don't quite trust them on his own. The rough stone wall, passage grate against your skin as you feel the way through the sewers. You stumble blindly as you plunge into the water. The commotion rouses a group of corrupted creatures taking refuge. They don't take kindly to your intrusion. Oh, this is a uh, fight. Okay, here we go. I'm actually really close to dead. I got to be careful. Oh, we're in a sewer. Yeah, yeah, sick, dude. How much health? Oh, it's just one? It's fine. Easy. What a cool looking, like, arena, though. Should be dead any second now. What the hell? Lay a loser. Apple. Yeah, got him. Oh, yeah. Nah, nah, nah. The final monstrosity falls gurgling. Malaclips gazes at the bodies with a troubled look on his face. This one is wearing a necklace. Looks like a family heirloom. The bard, usually fond of looting, doesn't allow you to touch the necklace. You peer up at the access tunnel. It is set too high into the wall. You won't be able to get back that way. Explore? Oh, right. Let's get that huge success, man. Dude, I'm so good at following them cards right now, dude. How do you change the picture in your profile? I mean, it's much more easier if you go on a computer and do it. I'm not sure how to do it from your phone. All right. Pull the rope or climb the rope. Rope hangs. We'll climb it. You leap into the rope and immediately it releases, falling you into a coil at your feet. You're not very clever, are you? <laughs> we should have pulled it. You peer up. It sits too high. You won't be able to go back that way. Find a way out. Damn it. All right. Come on. Huge success. Let's go. Oh, no. It's, it's either two or three. Yes. All right. What's this? While searching for the exit, you find a sealed crate of honey toffees. We'll take the toffee. 
Ooh, five food. Malchus beckons you to a wrought iron gate. If I'm not mistaken, and, and I never am, how dare you question me? This will take us directly into the fort. He allows you to go fo foist. He allows you to go foist. You leave the moisture and the murk of sewers behind you. You find yourself in a cellar, wine caskets, jars of pickled vegetables, sizable iron cage, wreathed in posing light. Within the cage, a missing children huddle, unsure of your intentions. Hey kids, I got toffee. Malaclips reaches for the heavy lock upon the gate. It sizzles. By freight, a skirt that burns. He presses a long metal implement into your hand and steps back. You gently touch the lock, it doesn't burn you. You attempt to pick the lock. What the hell is this? I've never done this before. The pendulum swings like a scythe, bearing hope or failure. Uh, what do you want me to do? Okay. Nicely timed. With a click, the lock pops open and clatters to the floor. Okay, children. Malaclips awkwardly pats one on the head. Your mother and I are gonna kill the old bad man. You stay here unless we die, which in case you're on your own. The children nod, no terror. Ooh, you sneak up past the stairs and survey the scene before you. The soldiers mill about the fort's courtyard. I know you played uh, World War II, where you played Black Ops, uh, Zombies, or Multiplayer. No, I have not done that one. Malaclips draws his spellbook. I have an incantation that will co covertly teleport a few soldiers away from here. Potential to the deaths. But I require some of your blood. Why do you need my blood? Alright, do it. It's fine. Permanent five. Whatever, we're still at 100. Your blood drips from a rune line page. Oh god, what is happening? <gasps> Alright. Was I supposed to get that other one over there? That's fine, whatever. So we're gonna fight three steel, I think. Shadow you developed a group of soldiers. This. Huh? Clearly you lack what it takes. Yo, fuck you, man. They tumble onto the ground before vanishing from sight. Oh, we did it. Malaclips draws a spellbook. I have an incantation that will do more. I'll fight the soldiers now, let's go. Wow, this is a very long little, like, a little scenario. That's because it's part of your companion. They're only children. You should have let them be. Nice. They even have like dialogue for the scenario. That's cool. All right, killing two in sixty seconds, no problem, dude. Easy. What's up, man? Welcome to the stream. How you doing today? Oh, you bastard! I was gonna use my 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 ult. Really? <laughs> have I done Infinite Warfare a campaign? I have not. The World War II campaign is pretty good, though. I really liked it when I did it. Not bad, all told. Malaclip states anticlimactically. I'll go fetch a little bundle bundles of joy, shall I? The bard comes striding up the stairs, plucking his loots. So the frightened maid shall and follow behind. We a did it! First well. try. I'm so glad we did it. Now on with children. Malaclips covertly leads the children onto a covered barge by the docks. Onward to your new home with madmen to force forward. The children glance at you in alarm as they meekly duck into the boat. Nice. Dude. Pretty sick, man. Great. Treacherous wilds. And uh, we lose one equipment. <gasps> Our cutthroat's blade. Whatever, that's fine. I wasn't even using it. Open wilds, hell yeah, what do we got? We found 10 bucks, that's cool. We have six, oh yeah, nice. Every time we get gold, we get food. Even Dangerous wilds. <gasps> oh thing. no. I didn't read it, whatever, let's go. Dun, 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 dun. Why do you keep getting us into these situations? My bad, boys. Damn, dude, this campaign's getting long already. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have to cut some campaigns in half for videos, probably. Oh my god, I keep messing up. Gotta get that repost, though. It's like a much simpler, like, 
Not gonna lie, it's like a simple Assassin's Creed like combat style. But it's supposed to be like the fun story roguelike kind of stuff, and you um, messing around with the deck that makes this game like really, really awesome. What's up, man? Almost had one more repulse there. Nah, nah, nah. All right, what do we get? Two fame and a new equipment for the one I lost. Oh, a new Not helmet. Elegant, but possibly effective. Nice. This one has no requirements. Bash an enemy. Oh, to hell yeah! Bash an enemy and block, or remove their armor to cause a brief stun. Map reveal. After every encounter with a gamut, reveal one random encounter and only one helmet. That's just plus plus ten defense. That's really good. Dude, the armor of gluttony is amazing. Like holy crap, dude! I'm getting so such good stuff out of it. Oh my god. Oh, treacherous wilds. Lost the food. Okay, it's fine. I gotta chase that relic, by the way. Pit pocket. Oh, sick. The, the pit pocket one. Let's keep stealing. Let's steal it all. I wasn't looking. Crap. Okay. Alright, go for the 10 gold. Let's go. Oh, so easy, dude. So easy. Are you kidding me? Game, come on, dude. Keep all the gold. Split the spoils with the merchant. What happens if I do that? I might get like a random item, huh? I might. Oh my god, every go oh. Dude, armor of gluttony is amazing. Like it's 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 a savior in this scenario in this campaign. All right, bless you, stranger. And oh, I got a blessing. Indomitable will. Player cannot starve to death, but go down to one life. <laughs> uh, that's interesting. The treacherous wild has been revealed. I gotta get that freaking thing up there. Come here. I have Shift these salesmen. Trust Buy the relic for 40 and negotiate a better price. True bargains are rarely found with I mean, those who let's just spend the money. To wait it's okay. Their customers to test their wares. Okay, so we got this one. I got a new curse. Great. Um, bad wager? Pilford pockets. Lose one gold each time you are hit. For 10 for each encounter. That's fine. It is not one game now, but a score. Oops. Each with its own nuance and delicate approach. Break camp. I can't see the freaking map, yo. The open wilds, fame and shame. Okay, let's do this. Open wilds. A uh, nourishing meal. Okay, what fame and shame. Oops, I, I don't even know what the hell I clicked. I don't know what the hell I clicked. You oh my god, I don't know what the hell happens around your last for fate. Balanced spirit. You may not gain a blessing while you have more blessings and curses. That's fine, but like holy crap. <laughs> I <laughs> my bad boys. Uh, okay. No much exchange. We have not done this one yet. Hold the wily humans, a voice calls out. It takes a moment to realize they are gnomes. Dirty, poorly armed gnomes. They hold a few spears, but most have a rock and sharpened stick. We seek arms to defend ourselves. A gnome declares loudly, hand over some equipment or we release you. Uh, I'll give you some food for a helmet. I'll give you some armor if you give me a health potion. Give them something? Oh, no, no, no. Fuck that. You guys don't get shit. Some rocks fly in my direction. Oh, great. So the no- Oh my god, dude. So the no much exchange. That's a pretty shitty one, isn't it? Dangerous wilds. Great. God dang it. I'm just trying to uncover all of it because, you know, it's better that way. I'm going to have to walk backwards. Get him. I'm so close to finishing my... Uh, my weapon challenge. Is that dead? Twitch just crashed. Dang, dude, the app feels bad, dude. 
Remember, every time we get a hit, we lose one gold. It shouldn't matter that much, right? I hope this works. Deadly. Nice, get wrecked. Two fame and ten max life. Nice. Oh yeah, we still have the cartographer to go after. <gasps> the caravan robbery. We have to go do that one. Okay, so we're gonna walk all the way back here. Hooray for the five food! Alright. Let's keep going. What's down there? Dangerous wilds. 27 revealed encounters. Uh, 27 revealed. Is that all of them? Hold on. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 1, 2, 3, 4. 4 times 7. Oh, okay, we got them all. Wait, is there seven? Four and three, yeah, there's seven. How come he's not giving me the token, man? I don't get it. Oh, we got it. Okay, we got it. I'm not sure if it was... I'm not, I'm not sure how we got that, but sure. Okay. Yes, Treacherous Wilds. Lost one food. Oh, no. All right. Let's do this one right here. At the caravan robbery. Nice. The next uh, encounter in our thievery questline. Same concerns. You find Merrick sitting in the shade of a precarious boulder at the edge of a ravine, just in time, standing up, dusting off his hands. A procession of trade caravans and carriages makes its way to a great city. You can crawl to the edge of the ravine and peer over the crest. I ambush the traders. I am not normally one to create a scene, but time is of the essence. You must find the caravan of a particular cartographer. Merrick explains, among his possessions is a map of the Great Sands. Find it for me. If you happen upon anything else of value, you can keep it. Just bring me that map. With a great heave, you dislodge the large boulder, sending it crashing down into the carriage's path. The driver of the first carriage sounds an alarm, blowing a great horn in an attempt to notify any patrolling Empire guards. The sound echoes through the gorge. While the rest of the procession in disarray, you quickly descend into the valley and approach the first cavern. Holy nuts, dude. I don't even know what I want here. I'll take the food. It's probably, we're probably just gonna have to keep rolling, huh? Uh, you, you grab the produce, raid another cabbage. Oh, we have to get, oh, okay. We specifically have to get the map, otherwise, GG, right? Is that it right there? Hold on. I don't think the map is on this one. Nope, there was the treasure map. Damn it. I think that was it. Actually, let, let's redraw this. Yes, we got it. That's it. All right, I'm getting better at these rolls, man. That's it. And miss the chaos, you find the wagon that Merrick had described. As the cartographer attempts to temper uh, the horses, you sneak aboard through his papers and parchments. Tucked under a bottle, you got it. The map of the Great Sands. All right, let's, let's leave. We got it. Ah, sick. Two fame. I'm pretty sure that's all we needed to do, right? You find Merrick waiting where you left him. His eyes grow wide at the side of the map, and with the flourish, it disappears beneath his cloak. Tell no one of this, he says with a smile. Meet me at the edge of the sands in three nights' time. Nice. Nice, dude. Nice, dude. We have 42 fame, dude. Legit. Okay, we can get out of here now. We get the last relic and then finish this campaign. Oh, two of four, it says, found. I think we get the third one. And then we're gooch. There is little I can say that will stop an adventure of ancient artifacts. All right. The village of Jernit is unremarkable, save for a tiny near forgotten shrine. Here you find another relic resting on a dusty altar. An old woman greets you. I see you are interested in our relic. Local legends tell of a time when a great hero will come to claim it. Until then, it remains here under our watch. I'm the hero. <laughs> oh, you have arrived. Here you go. Oh, that was easy. And a new wielder will gain a curse, and the curse we obtained is the Wheel of Confusion. 
All the wheel gamuts reverse in reverse direction. I mean, that doesn't matter. The same thing. Another accursed relic, Malaclips grumbles. I swear, if before Malaclips can finish, the relic starts to vibrate and glow in unnatural light. Your eye is drawn to a similar glow emanating in response from a distant tower. Do you think they're trying to tell us something? Let's get moving. Okay. Alright, to the final relic we go. And now you must begin to ask yourself how these threads connect. Were you simply a patsy for the Empire? Or did you hope to be something greater? The relics lead you to a mysterious tower. You will need to ascend it to reach the mage at its summit. Enter the tower. What's that red one? I can't even read it. I don't know. That's probably bad, though. Wow, five life curses. That would have been bad. Success, Sue. As you climb the tower stairs, a voice calls down. Do you even know why you're here? How much did they tell you? You continue to wind your way up. Sick, sick. All right, you finally reach the top. You've been sent here to do the bidding of the true enemy. These relics can be used to defeat him, but here you are looking to return to him. Uh oh, I see you bring the relics, the mage says with a grin. A thief can't be trusted to deliver on a job, but one can always rely on the predictability of the empire to send their dogs. She holds the remaining relic out, mockingly. I suppose you'll be wanting this. What the hell? Take it, she says calmly. But be warned, its curse will sap your strength and your will to fight, and combat is inevitable, I'm afraid. Or, she continues, you can let me keep it. Should you best me, it will be lost to you forevermore. Uh, take the relic, right? Uh, another curse. Alone, your companion will aid you during gambits. Whatever, dude. The relic is heavier than you thought. Uh, okay. Your Imperial Masters will be most proud. Prepare to meet your fate. Alright, you struggle to lift a weapon as a group of thieves join the fray. Nice. I mean, it happens. It happens, Plum. Alright, so we got every one, every relic. All we have to do is beat this guy and then we get gold. Sick. This mage went through extraordinary lengths to gather these relics. Mage shoot projectiles from a distance. Use evade. Oh, I don't have a, I don't have my my peoples here. Uh, are these thieves? These are thieves. I I should be able to handle this. This one. Son of a beezy. Son of a beezy. Get out of my face. Ah! It points. Holy crap. Please, lady. Calm down. I can't stand in those circles, right? Seems good, man. Just keep pushing her out of the circle. And it's over. Oh, through the face. Wow. All right. With the relics recovered, you're, you journey back to the Imperial City to claim your reward. Sick. Captain Estrella meets with the city gates. I'll take you straight to the Chief Council. She'll be eager to examine what you've brought back. On the walk back to the palace, you explain that you've safely recovered all the relics. This may be a rare day when the Council will smile, Estrella says. You can see her trying to catch the words as they've come out. My apologies. This is indeed another glorious day for the Empire. The chief council looks over the relics you return. You have done well. We shall keep these relics safe, lest they fall into less learned hands. We did it. All right. Oh, we did a lot in this campaign. Holy crapsicles. Every part of this tale is a part okay. of your history. Empire a contact, part of the that palace, armory, exploring the wilds, a winding trail, and 
Excuse me? Deadly forest? Okay, okay. seems good. Ability clubs. Those are two-handed weapons. Sick. For befriending the Empire, your supplies have been added. Doom, 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 doom. Uh, for safely recovering every relic. So this is the gold... Um, holy crap, the man of the world. That's the gold reward. And then, of course, the ones we finished throughout the, um, throughout the mission. For rescuing the mage children, we unlock the next step up on Malaclipse's journey. Uh, this is for the cartographer, the duel. Oh, interesting. I wonder what that means. And then finally, for raiding the caravans, we get the desert trek. We got so much, man. And another gold. Whew, holy crap. Alright, I still feel bad about this one. Oh, yeah.